Haven't been afraid of a good fight. Never will be. Just like I never back down. I will destroy. And I will make you rest in ashes. <laughs> God. I was having a good day, too. Y'all ever fiddle around on a website, be it a 4chan, Twitter, Tumblr, God help you, and you say shit and you do shit you would never really do in real life, but there's always that one, one touched individual that's a little more touched than the rest of you idiots, that takes it a little too far and thinks it's all real, thus ruining the vibe for everyone? That's this guy! And for a new fun-filled show for this page, I bring you to... Don't be that guy! Tale of life lessons learned by watching What Not to Do by Others. And who is that guy? G Flash EX. Don't be that guy. This dude has a grand total of eight, maybe nine days on this platform, at least that's by the date of the, the oldest video that I found, and has spent the entire time whinging about VTubers and harassing people, fuck knows what reason. Why am I talking about this person? Well, let's look at the other side of that coin. This is Ray Dahl. A random VTuber, lewd tuber that does games and shit on Twitch. Your basic fair, nothing really to comment about, mostly. Until Lord Scruffles over here has decided to stalk and harass the ever loving fuck out of her incessantly, being weird things to her, like, you know, homophobic, transphobic, dead namery, and misogyny. You know, things in general that I personally could not give a fuck less about. But to others, acts like this should warrant a swift and proper blockening. I bequeath. A boot to the head. And thus a moving on afterwards. And that is exactly what she did. To about 12 different accounts of his. Don't be that guy. Multiple times she has told him, in far nicer words than I would use, to piss off. Only to have a string of videos made about her and a constant barrage of whingery and bullshit. Folks, bitches, bastards, insert 2700 other genders here. Don't be that guy. There are groups out there that may find you unpleasant, even repulsive. That's not every group of individuals. Some may find your scruffiness charming and ask how the pet bird that is nested in your beard is doing. It is important for you to figure out which groups will accept you and which will not. This is something that normally you learn in school, and most times, depending on how you look, act, and occasionally smell, and so on, you learn quickly to gravitate towards the popular kids, or the nerd kids, or the athletic kids, or be relegated to the ass end of society by hanging out with the weird kids that rave under a bridge all day and ponder why they are born while listening to shit music. Oh, oh god, no, no, not that shitty, please, have some class. Somehow, around this point, Radon popped up on my Twitter feed, I, I don't even, I don't even know why. But, I got curious, and looked into whatever the fuck was going on. And, after reading a small amount, I decided to interact with this guy. Why? Well, two reasons. One, I kinda wanna be a VTuber one day, and although with the amount of drama that's going on among them constantly, that's a swiftly waning desire of mine. I do want I do want to do some Twitch things here and on YouTube as a, you know, sentient tea bag that lives in a cup just steeping his way through life. And I have my eye on being a VTuber communities a bit because of that. And two, I, I got annoyed with apartment hunting, so I got bored and curious and decided and I really do enjoy like engaging and interacting with people and learning about them. I like helping them around whenever they have the chance. Just I'm weird, don't mind me. I like people. So, I went on to his YouTube page, I found himself a couple of videos based on this lady, and um, I'm not gonna draw, bore you all with those because by the time this video is created, all of that has been deleted. Thankfully, I am quite swift when it comes to screen recordings. Um, I will, however, take a couple little bits out of that because I must say some of these takes are mag-fucking-nificent. Let's go through the video real quick. Age restricted, not safe for work artist. And this person's name just appeared out of nowhere. Yeah, we already have proof that's not true. Her account popped up. And this was back when I was using my character account. So I decided to follow her after I created my main account that had my real name. She has me blocked on my real on my ma real main account. And she is talking shit. And not only that, she is gone is telling her followers, her friends, to massively report my main account. 
Well, when you harass people on Discord servers or online and or even in person generally, a swift blockening is the bare minimum of what you should expect. The sending of friends on mass to flag, I, while I don't condone mobbing, I, I, there's there's reason behind to this one. Stop stalking me and stop following me on different platforms. Stop making outs to follow me. I'm begging you for... Okay, first off, I didn't follow you voluntarily, okay? First off, read dial, red dial, whatever the fuck your name is. I follow you because your fucking account on this platform was um shown up when I followed a LouTuber or a night a NSFW artist, okay? I didn't follow you voluntary. What? What the fuck? What possessed you? What? Who? What? What ghost? What demon from the darkest nether regions of my anus climbed into your body, dragged your meat beating arm over to the follow button and made you click it? I didn't fall off my own volition. I followed against my will. What the fuck statement is that? What the actual flying fuck? What is wrong with people, honestly? I could say the same damn thing for most of you fucking fuckers who turn on each other within the VTuber or the VR chat community. I could ask the same damn question about all of you. Honestly, there is a lot of drama between your own. I'm very curious as to why. No, I haven't harassed you. And I haven't stalked you, stalked you. Again, you're making baseless and meritless claims just so you can get your... So you can whip your friends and your community up into a frenzy to attack me because you're a clout seeker. You're trying to gain clout by trying to get me canceled. Clout seeking. Clout chasing. From someone with fewer subs than even I have. It'd be funny if it weren't so pathetic. No, what the heck? I'll laugh anyway. <laughs> yeah, to change my user. Due to being scared and petrified i will be changing my user i sorry i don't feel safe with a stalker trying to find me again i'm not stalking you what is what 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 is this what 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 what, 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 what fuck is this hmm explain your community come can come after me but i will shut them down i will silence them and i will personally lawyer up and sue you for slander and defamation of character don't think i won't do it <laughs> try me you garden tool Folks, let's have a little class time, but what does slander mean? Noun. Oral communication of false and malicious statements that damage the reputation of another. Two. A false and malicious statement or report about someone. I mean, we have the evidence that shows that it's not false. Defamation. What is defamation? The act of faming, calumny, uh, calumny, calumny? Words. Fucking English is weird. Slander or libel. The act of defaming the wrong and injuring of another reputation without good reason or justification. I'm pretty fucking sure she's got a god goddamn reason. I don't think you have a case here, bruh. And this one right here. This one right here. Begged him to stop. No, you didn't. Okay, redial, you are lying. You are lying first and foremost because you never begged me to stop. I didn't get a DM. I didn't get a PM. I didn't get an email. I didn't even get a comment. I didn't get a comment from you in any of my previous videos. So no, I didn't. You did not beg me to stop. What? Uh, did you want a fucking pigeon as well? I've got strings here that show that you are not welcome. You know, the first block was the hint you should have taken at that point. If you come after me in my YouTube comments or you come after me on my Twitter page, I will make it a guarantee that you banned <laughs> good luck fucker i did i did this and i'm still on here that's pretty much the end of the video at that point he took it all down i i had to screenshot or uh, sorry screen record that thing as soon as i could because well if he ha was smart he was gonna but took him a while anyway uh so i went off and i attempted to speak with this individual the following is that interaction no i will not be doing a voice for him because uh, that's weird it's a character that's different. This is an actual person. I'm going to use my normal voice. <clears throat> I mean, y'all could just leave each other alone and live y'all fucking lives like an adult. T too much too much to ask? Unfortunately, she continues to slander me on her Twitter page to the point of where a lawsuit may have to get involved. I am prepared to do so. S slander how? Offer counter evidence, should there be any. Prove her to be misleading, if she is. And move on. I highly doubt a few tweets are worth tens of thousands of dollars in a slander case. 
Mind you, I'm on the outside looking in. I still haven't gone over all the shit she's posted working on it. I just keep seeing her face pop up, so I got curious. Because she's making accusations against me that is beyond stalking and harassing me behind her petty little block butt. I do believe I have a case if I can get an attorney to take it. Yep, people block people and talk shit about them. Christopher, cited, Christopher Titus proceeded to take something I said way the fuck out of contest, block me, and talk shit for days. It's Twitter. It's about as important as Congress thinks it is, and about as secure as the little old lady on a subway at night in New York with a very easily jackable purse. People lob shit? It gets lopped back. Let it die or let the Streisand effect wave the fuck all over you. Which, by now, it seems that you're right there in the middle of. I'm in the middle of a damn community pack mentality. This is the same stuff I covered in my previous videos about how the community acts and why the anti-tubers are trying to get stuff like this canceled off platforms. There are some communities that don't jive with certain people. I'm fairly certain that very community would find my offensive ass pretty unwelcomed after as well. You're making a mountain out of a molehill, and I'm just curious as to why. Let it die, bruh. I'm not saying take the beating, just block as you go. But screaming will only draw more attention. And the more I read, the less I'm on your side. I'm, I'm impartial right now, and I'm, and I'm trying to help. Stop. Then Ray Dahl must stop her shit, or we both lose everything. I saw what she said on her Twitter page. If she wants to go all out and die upon the hill, then so be it. I will be her reaper. Now, this is getting into threat territory, and I ain't okay ever. That That's not okay. Don't be that guy. There is no reason at all, ever, to escalate the damn spat on a feckin' internet. On the feckin' internet. To threats of violence. It instantly makes you the bad guy in any situation. And I, I actually believe I say that coming up here in a bit. I don't really see that happening now. I mean, it shows right there in your own feckin' video her saying in a far nicer way than I would put, I would put piss off. The request has been made. Regardless of how it was made, it was made. And you continued. You have, without any hyperbole, done this to your damn self at this point. Now is when you stop, take a moment, rethink your tactics, and hopefully move on. The only tactic I'm thinking of now is being the Grim Reaper, Reaper to her pathetic career, and I plan on fighting to the bitter end. Ah, bitch woke up and chose violence today. Okay. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. And uh, how well is that working for you thus far? Aside from multiple nobodies blocking me on their Twitter feed and banning me from a pathetic Discord server, I'd say it's going pretty well. There. That right there. Nobody's blocking you from a Twitter and Discord. Something they are well within their right to do and something I'd encourage you to do as well. If they're nobodies, why do you care? If they slander you in the, to their audience of like 12 people, why do you care? Why the tirade? Why the shenanigans? Why the I will destroy you and make you, the, make you rest in ashes death threat? You have dug yourself a hole you cannot get out of. Like, how old are you, bruh? I would expect this from a 13-year-old lonely heat and age hate machine with a new computer and an old routine. <laughs> nah, sorry. I particularly don't see that sex tuber as a threat. However, making a mockery of my mental condition and my looks, that's when I get serious, even if it ruins me in the end. This is a stupid fight. This is not something you'll come out on top of. People make fun of everyone. Fuck everyone makes fun of everyone else behind their back. It is to be expected. I can only feckin' imagine what those fine frilly people have said about me while they have been watching this entire conversation. Personally, if I were to make jokes about you, the ammo you have provided would have me spoiled for choice. Grooming is a good thing. I, I, mean, the, I mean physical maintenance variety, not the kid diddling kind. Ew. And yet I have to behave for now. That is, no reason though to make death threats, most of which I am certain by now have been screenshotted and or screen recorded. That instantly puts you on the antagonist side and would be lovely evidence against you should police get involved. Think carefully about how you go about this. You can be quiet and move on from this dumbassery, or you can keep going and wind up a subject of down the rabbit hole, or worse, in jail, should you decide to should she decide to press charges. This is the last time I'm going to attempt to be helpful. Things have gone quiet since then, but he seems to have decided that he was 100% victorious over the unruly mob of uh, 
people he done pissed off. In reality, the, guy, the boy has gone so far that the woman is in question has now gotten the authorities involved. Folks, don't be this guy. Is this considered simping? God, I hope not. Now, all of you, you all may be, may be thinking I'm bullying or harassing this individual. On the contrary, after this, I will have no further interaction with this man, or Rydell, probably. And I will say it right now, do not, for any reason, go and harass this person. Don't talk to him. Don't, don't, don't do anything on my behalf. This strange individual, just, just leave him be. I am simply making this video in hopes to cultivate a following that doesn't do any of this. Perhaps you are, like I am, and learn what not to do by viewing the self-destruction of others. And thus I must share and attempt to make it funny. Keep talking bad about me. I don't care. In the end, I'm just living in all your heads rent-free. And there ain't a damn thing you can do to stop it. Yeah, yeah, um... About that. 